you can survive a tornado, but you need to know where to go depending upon what situation you're in. I'm not gonna take the time to show you where to go if you live in an apartment, say a mobile home, you're driving in your car, you're at the mall, or if you live in a house. The very best place to seek shelter from a tornado is going to be below ground in a place like a storm cellar or something like your basement. This offers you the best protection if a tornado would travel right over your house and gives you the best chance to survive. But if you don't have a basement, the best place to go is the centermost portion of your house. A lot of times it's going to be a bathroom as long as it doesn't have any windows. You want to get into the tub, cover yourself up with a blanket, and protect yourself from flying debris. Your next best option, if you don't have a bathroom in the center part of your house without windows, is actually to get into a closet like this, close the door, and cover yourself up and protect yourself from flying debris. Now what if you live in a dorm or an apartment that's got a lot of levels on it? Well, you don't want to be up here. Instead, you want to get down to the lowest level. Again, the same rules apply as to if you're in your house. If you're in an apartment, get down to the lowest level, so the first floor, and instead you actually want to make friends with the people who live downstairs and go inside with them. But what if you're in a public place like this, say the mall, and a tornado is bearing down on you? Well, actually, they have designated places, storm shelters that you can go in. And this place offers the best protection if a tornado were to hit the mall. Come in here, wait it out until they give you the all clear. Now, what if you're actually driving in your vehicle and a tornado approaches? Well, believe it or not, you want to get out. Stop your vehicle, turn on your flashers, find a low-lying area like this, a ditch, a depression, get down in here, cover yourself up with your arms, crouch down, and protect yourself from flying debris. Now, one place you definitely want to get out of if you live in and a tornado is coming is a mobile home. Mobile home parks like this are one of the most dangerous places to be in if a tornado strikes because the tornado can easily pick up these mobile homes and carry them away. And one more thing, it's a common myth. People think that if a tornado is coming, they need to get out of their car and get underneath one of these underpasses or overpasses. That's not the case. These things create a vacuum and actually can suck people right up from under here and take them out. Instead, you need to get out and get into a ditch. Hopefully next time when you hear these tornado sirens going off or that tornado warning scrolls across the bottom of your screen, you're gonna know where to go to stay safe and survive the storm.